Welcome to this video guys. Let's see how we can install Django and set up a Django project in Visual Studio Code. First, let's open Visual Studio Code. And I'll just create a new project here. Go on File, go on Open Folder. And let's create a new project folder for our project. So I'll just create this in desktop. I'll right click and click on New Folder. Let's call this my Django project. Or you can just click this new folder to create a new project. So after that, click Select Folder. And this folder will be opened in Visual Studio Code. Okay, now here we will set up our Django. Let's create a virtual environment where we will install Django because that is the standard practice. So click on Terminal here, click on New Terminal. And the command to create virtual environment is Python M V E N V and then give any name to your virtual environment folder. So I'll write dot venv. This dot represents that this folder will be hidden in Linux and Mac OS. So hit enter. As you can see, dot venv folder is created and it's still processing. It will create uh, some more files inside this. So let's wait till this is complete. While this is processing, check out our brand new awesome coding merch. We've got t-shirts, hoodies, we've got stickers for laptops or notebooks, cups, bags, and a lot more. Get it today from the link below. Once the virtual environment is created, we need to activate it. So just type the name of the folder, .venv, and slash. In Windows, it is forward slash. In Mac, Linux, uh, and Unix-based system, it's backward slash. After that, write scripts, and then activate. OK, hit Enter. And this will pop up in the front of your directory here. So this means that this virtual environment is active. Now let's install Django. So the command is pip install Django. Hit enter. After the installation is successful, we will create our Django project. So the command is Django admin start project and your project name. So that is my Django project and the folder where you want to set up files. So just enter dot here and hit enter. This means that all the Django project folders will be created inside this project. So as you can see, Django project folder is created and manager pi is also here. Now you can run your project by doing python manage.py and run server. Hit enter and your Django server will be run. So as you can see, some additional files are created and our server is running here. If I press control and click on this link, as you can see, Django page will open. So this is the default Django page. Now you can create apps in this project folder and you are good to go. If you have any questions, let me know in the comments below.